Hi there, welcome to number one geek. It is I, Saz, and we're back with some more Project Zomboid. It's going to be a busy day today. As you can tell, I've come back from the... Uh... I'm going to second note. I've come back from the uh, fire station, uh, and I've been uh, having a think, and I'm wondering if I need to... If there is a library at the... Um... The prison. So today might be a bit of a prison break. But what I've done is on the way back, I did check to see if that car that I originally picked up... Oh, do you know what I haven't done? It's too busy talking. Uh, oh yeah, so I also bought used the wagon to bring uh, a barbecue back for uh, recycling water, just in case I need to. But uh, what I want to do is grab a couple of these cans. Two of them, stick them in the trolley. Yeah, so I checked the, uh, the van that I was originally looking at back in the day, uh, and I found that I had left the key in it, so that is actually a bit of a boon. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head down there, taking out any zombies that I can as on my way, um, and uh, what we'll do from there is uh, fill up the car and head over to the prison and see where we know from there. Back in a bit. Okay, so we're getting ourselves into the area now. Having a bit of fun. Avoiding all the zombies as we can. Just have a quick look around to make sure that the coast is clear, so to speak. Let's uh, get this bad boy filled. Empty gas can there, and I suspect I'm going to need to add that empty gas can there. Put that back in primary. And we have vehicle. We're off. So hopefully the prison has a library. If it doesn't, it's going to end up being a little bit uh, tricky. I don't have, say, Gore King's ability with a shotgun to... This is where the helicopter went, so this is probably where every single zombie is as well. So it may not have been the best idea, says. But hey. Okay. I'll probably have attracted quite a few zombies towards me, but let's deal with each. Ah, oh. there's a key underneath that police car. 
Now that's an interesting uh, development. I do have an idea. Maybe a silly one, but maybe just use that. Uh... Oof, there's quite a few zombies in there, isn't about the bodies just yet. Let's get this area. Oh, Jesus, look at these these prison guards, you think? Yeah, looks like it. Some of these might have double holsters. A kitchen knife or a hunting knife stuck in his leg, do you reckon? Might be a hunting knife. Yep. Already picked up a holster. Oof. That is a lot of zombies. Got you see me. Right, I, I, I may have a little bit of time here. Because there's an absolute horde in that, uh, that place. So I need to deal with these as... Hopefully use the window as a, you know, obviously a portal. There we go. Just maximise the distance between the two. That'll do. Grab some food as well. Let me put that Franklin Vorline key on my key ring. Hopefully this time I won't burn myself to death while I'm there. Uh... I'm not going to go sneaky on them, I just want to get them away from that window 
as quickly as I possibly can. If I can track them out one at a time, that's good. Ooh, I think I've already got some pliers, but there you go. Two I can take on, that's not a problem. There's a hammer there, I'll take that. I suppose I really should be putting them in the... Uh... Yeah, let's start putting stuff... I didn't actually... Did I actually eat that chocolate? Interesting. I think I'm going to spend a little time clearing these out. I'm not going to spend all the time letting you watching you because it's not exactly the most interesting thing because I've got to draw them out and then kill them. So uh, I'll be back once I've managed to at least get some decent headway. Okay, well it looks like a lot of the guys have broken through here. Whoa. So, most of them are pretty much outside. Just trying to attract as many out as possible. It is getting to an easier point, though. Oops. Tom doesn't need to scratch my nose as well. Getting tired. There's not a lot that can be done about that for the moment. I'm going to have to deal with the. Uh... Try to deal with the horde first. Right, I think I'm going to have to take the hint. Maybe uh, get out of here. I'm, I've run out of water. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Uh, well, let's see what I can do first. up here I can get into and just sleep. No, I don't think there is. Okay. I think I might have to head back to the fire station. So I'll catch you back there when I'm ready. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, we've got to manage to get ourselves over there. I did run these guys up. I think this guy's still alive. Oh. 
what I will do. Just have those firefighter stuff, because they might be useful for uh, future use. Thought I heard a noise there. Right, let's head back to the uh, prison. Don't have any. Oh, guess we do have lots. Try and avoid all these guys as best we can. Actually, shouldn't need to be too uh, precious about this van, because I know I've got a police car down there with a key. Problem is, I can't get enough speed. And around we go. See so if we can get some speed here. And I'm hearing a lot of deaths. There goes the front lights anyway. I think. Oh no, maybe not. Let's avoid this slot for the for, for main street.
Boom, boom, boom. Bum, 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 bum. Let's run over these bodies to see if any of these guys are actually still alive. I don't know whose keys this Frank Vorlein, okay. I wonder if anything I can just Let's make sure these guys are dead. Well, Operation Flatten Zombie seems to have uh, managed to be fairly successful. Mostly successful. Let's see if I can get this key first. That's actually not that key, is it? Well, oh, bugger. Is it this one here then? Oh, it's this one. No fuel in that one. So it's in the back of the police car then. Ooh, the hiking bag. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to end up being able to do this by the end of the day. Um. Have I bitten off a bit more than I can chew? And I think the answer to that is yes. Very much so. So what do I do? Do I leave it or do I get persistent? Or do I become a little bit more sneaky about this? A 
Hello, you. Mighty. Come on, you. He's doing. Guy from a wedding's doing it a prison, is not it? Right, let's deal with this guy. Okay, well that's something I can take apart a bit later. I don't suppose there's anything in this fridge that might be useful for me. You know, lettuce, rotten lettuce. Stuck behind there. Ooh. Shower room. Don't drop the soap. Hmm. I'll take those very snap tarts. I'm gonna put that coffee back. I'm just gonna rest here for a second. Now I'm hearing zombie noises. Don't know how the hell I'm going to get to those guys. Um, now the question is, is there a library? I think I'm running here. Yeah, I'm running. Okay, we're at 30 minutes. 
I'm a bit tired. This may take a little bit longer than I'd hoped. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video for a second and see where we go. If I make the decision to give up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and do some deforestation by the main by my main base in preparation for uh, building the fences and stuff. Stand here. It's a tower. Is there a door? Huh. There's a potential victim, however. Potential couple of victims. There is a door there. There might be some weaponry or something in there that I can use. At least a place I can rest. with me? That's the other question. No. So I'm not, probably not going to break in unless I can actually get in. I can get in. Good, okay. Take the house key. It's club hammer, green paint. Let's rest on that chair. Good while. Can I sleep here though? Especially with that body lying there. Waking a little bit shocked. Okay, I'm going to leave it for there for the moment and we'll see what happens a bit later on and I'll let you know forward and backwards where we go. See you later. Look what I found. I'll take you. I was looking for the uh, library, but there we go. Picked up a, um, a nightstick. So I'm hoping, I've, I've, I've actually heard that the nightstick does actually have a really good um, critical attack. So, uh, uh, oh, did they spot me? Just want to have a quick check. Just make sure they are done. Okay, I'll uh, I'll come back to you once I'm uh, once I'm ready. Okay, well as you can see, I uh, <laughs> didn't quite make it. Um, true for the matter being, 
that in the end it turned out that uh, I didn't have enough weaponry to, uh, to deal with that. I started using the shotgun and then every zombie in the world came along so it had to be a big fat no I'm afraid. But all I'm doing now, as you can see you may notice that my aiming has gone up quite considerably seeing as I was running around using a shotgun that was supplied by the uh, place also my carpentry should be going up as well the thing I'm looking for is the pottery book so that I can get the kiln sorted and started because the kiln does generally tend to be a very good uh, starting block in the game and so I'm going to have to start looking for some more books. I, I tried with the uh, tried with the prison. I think I failed, to be honest. But uh, I think what I'll do now is just take the time. I'm going to have to find a lot of nails as well. But uh, we'll see where we go with this. Let me just speed this up. on the floor. So 108 planks I've got so far. That's quite good. Do I have any nails on me right now? Like a box of nails perhaps? I've got one set of nails. Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it there guys. I just want to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you like, press the like button. If you dislike what you dislike, press the dislike button. But please pop something down in the comment section to let me know how I can improve your content for you. Um, I'll tell you what, I've been out of this for quite a while now. I was desperately trying to get that uh, prison sorted, but I think it's all a big fat no for me. But there you go. Can't win them all. Anywho, thanks for watching, guys. See you soon. Bye-bye.